A welcome back to your Carolina. As if COVID-19 wasn't bad enough, there are now scams that are surrounding both the vaccination and, you know, uh, the virus cure out there. So we wanted to bring in V. Daniel. She's the president of the and CEO of the Better Business, Business Bureau of the Upstate. V, uh, good to see you. Happy New Year to you. Happy New Year to you. And thanks for having me, Jamarcus. Of course. And the Better Business Bureau is really dedicated to making sure people aren't scammed, aren't uh, you know scammed out of their money or their identity or their important information. And COVID-19 has been, you know, had its impact on us in, in, in a lot of different ways, but now it's trying to go after in the form of a scam. Tell us about the top three scams that you guys are seeing related to COVID-19. Um, the top three scams that we are seeing is more that it has to do with the vaccines, um, testing kits, and then actually phony cures. Um, scammers are coming up with some pretty wacky ideas um, but, you know, they're there for a reason. They are there because they want to make money. And it's easy It's easy to do with scammers. And I'm sure you guys see this a lot of times when there's something that everyone is dealing with. Uh, obviously, something like a pandemic is something we haven't had to deal with before. But they're preying on people that are looking for something desperately. And the vaccine is one of those things that everybody really wants. So we can go back to some sense of normalcy. But I, I'd imagine there are some red flags that pop up when people are talking about vaccine and trying to scam you out of your information. Absolutely. I mean, you know, they're selling fake vaccines and other treatments in so many different ways. And what they do is they try to cash in on the vaccine release. Um, you know, everybody is definitely looking at whether they're deciding whether they want to do the vaccine or not. And then all of, all of a sudden you have a test, you know, have a scammer calling and saying, you know, we're, we have this going on and we can sell you this, you know, um, um, this, uh, you know, tea, this COVID cure tea as a product that will actually, you know, um, fit you well until you can get the vaccine. So people, if it sounds too good to be true, that's one of the red flags you should be looking for, right? Absolutely, because there's so many people right now looking to get the vaccine. And, you know, as the president had announced that, you know, it's going to be a little bit longer for, you know, many people to get the vaccine. Um, because there hasn't been enough of the um, vaccines um, put out there. But so, you know, we're, you know, it's when something like this happens, I mean, like it's always, I mean, the scammers are looking for those opportunities. Right. National, uh, natural disasters, all of these things that are going on, they're looking for that. Uh, I would imagine, too, it's interesting to pay attention to the headlines, watch the local and national news, because you, you really hear what the president, what Dr. Fauci, what all these Absolutely. folks are saying about it. So you can kind of compare it to what this, random email may be sending you. Yeah, I mean, you know, government agencies, stay stay in contact, I mean, you know, with the consumer, stay in contact with the CDC. CDC, FDA, the Federal Trade Commission, all of them have so much information. And also, you know, currently right now, there's only two vaccines that are actually authorized and approved to prevent COVID-19. Mm -hmm. And those two vaccines are the Pfizer and the Moderna. And that's all you need to know right now. There are trials coming up. You know what I mean? They're doing a lot of trials on some other ones that they're going to approve. But uh -huh. always go to those sites. I mean, you know, I always say, when in doubt, check it out. So if you have a scammer calling you and saying, you know, they have a, a cure or they have a testing kit that, you know, they're saying that it's a secret testing um, kit that the government doesn't even know about. Mm -hmm. um, you know, if there's a, you know, they're selling, um, um, fake vaccines or other treatments in any other way, check it out. Go and make sure that you're going to those sites. I mean, they're pretty easy to get to and they're, you know what I mean? And the information is very spelled out. Yeah, and, and right now the government is not asking you to pay for a vaccine. So if anybody's asking you for any money, then it's, it's clearly a, that's a red flag that you need to pay attention to. Right. And how they're kind of getting by with that, um, um, Jamarcus, is by saying like, you know, this herbal tea or this, um, what was the other things, um, some of the other ones that I thought was essential oils, uh -huh. um, you know, um, vitamin C, we've got a vitamin C that's a cure. There is no cure. There's only those two vaccines to prevent you from getting COVID-19. And that's great information. So good information coming from the Better Business Bureau. V, is, is there a way for people to go on and keep a track of which scams are out there, which ones they should be looking for? Because they change probably, I'm sure, weekly, if not daily. Uh, and you guys are always tracking them to make sure that people are aware of them. Is there a place where people can go or yeah. they can call well, to report one? 
Mm -hmm. um, actually, you know, with our scam tracker, I mean, we have a scam tracker where we see a lot of this come in. Um, and actually, we share that with with the, with the law enforcement and everything as well. Um, with the FD, FTC, um, you know, if it's, if it's, you know, really bad, that's just where the, the scammer, and we're seeing it happen a lot, the FTC does a lot of that. But they can go to the BBB.org backslash scam tracker. You can report a scam. Anyone that's called you, emailed you, texted you that's saying that they have, that's, that a scammer has a, a, a cure, report it. Because the more that we report, the more that we can see it and where it's happening across the U.S. So I would go to, you know, definitely go to BBB.org backslash scam tracker. But also, you know, go to our social media plat platforms. We are always sending scam alerts um, on our social media, especially Facebook. So you, you know, you'll be you'll be um, alerted of the scams that are happening, especially with COVID nineteen. Dee Daniels, the president of the Better Business Bureau of the Upstate, you and your team are always great at keeping us up to date on what to watch out for. So we are protecting our information, our identity, all the things that we want to want to keep safe. So B, thank you so much for this, and uh, we'll put all this information for you at our website, yourcarolina.tv. B, always good to see you. Good to see you too, um, Demarcus. But make, to all the consumers out there, stay well and definitely be savvy when it comes to these scammers.